सर इन डायरेक्ट एनालिसिस शुड आई यूज फुल और रिड्यूस ई एन आई फॉर द रिफ्लेक्शन चेक so i just got this doubt from the student during stat training and if you are into stat or direct analysis you might have it too so let's clear it up with the real world example so imagine you are designing a long span steel beam you run the direct analysis in stat and strength checks pass but your deflection seems too large so you might think why is that because in direct analysis stat automatically reduces the modulus of elasticity and moment of inertia to simulate the second order effects and imperfection see this affects the deflection results too but here is the important part see for serviceability checks like ensuring the beam doesn't sag too much you need to use the actual or that is unreduced value of eni but see According to the technical reference manual which is for the stat in that particular there is a command for this which is reduced ei0 see this particular command tells stat to use full e or i for the deflection check calculations so here is the key takeaway see stat reduces eni for the strength checks by default but for accurate deflection checks always you can set reduce ei0 option Now if you got more stat or structural engineering doubts drop them in the comments and I'll explain them in the simple terms follow civil nirman for more stat and structural engineering tips till then I'll see you in the next video and remember don't just learn software learn concepts thank you